Hi, my fabulous friends. It's Donna, and today I'm talking to those of you born in the year of the monkey about what's coming up in November. And this month, I'm changing it up a little bit. I'm uh, looking at the individual planet energies to give you guys more specific information. And starting with where the spotlight's going to be. The spotlight uh, this month in November is really on those parts of your life that maybe are not as visible to other people. So the things that you're trying to hide from other people, and this is a really great opportunity to clear out bad habits, to let go of guilt, to let go of things that are really stopping you. And these are the things that maybe you're not telling other people, or maybe you're not even conscious of yourself, but you know that there's a block because if you have a real strong desire to move forward on something, but you just don't seem to be getting traction, it can be that there's a block and the blocks can come from something external or can come from something internal. This is the spotlight on internal blocks to see if they're there and to get them removed. Now, the where your money focus is, is uh, very strongly centered with you. You are... Uh, your charisma, your uh, attractiveness, your ability to get other people to support you is very, very high this month. This means that what you can do is you can go out into the world with confidence. You can speak in front of people. You can go ask individuals for help. You're going to get a much more positive response. This also works in the area of love. If you are looking for a relationship, your attractiveness level is much higher this month than it has been in previous months. So that means, you know, go to mixers, go to singles functions, uh, you know, go to even business networking meetings and you're going to find that people are attracted to you. Now, in addition, where I see the best use of action, where if you're going to want to take a, any sort of action, the most bang for your buck is going to be in the area of communication. That is sending out emails, writing blog posts, maybe even doing a video uh, blog, a vlog, uh, something where you're putting your information and what it is uh, out in the world. And this is going to bring you the most results business wise, but also socially. You know, just posting some things on Facebook, you're going to find that people are responding, that you're getting people to follow you, they are sharing what you're doing, so you're getting real engagement. And then where your luck is centered, and we're going to be talking about this for months to come because this is a longer aspect, but your luck is up there in the area of future and friendship. So it's a great combination. This means that let's say you've really wanted to make a connection with a particular person. Uh, maybe they're a celebrity or perhaps they are doing something very important in your field. You can now start to ask people, you know, hey, do you know this person? Uh, you know, can you, can you get me some sort of connection with this person? And how this works is you just start with your friends. You just go to your friends and you say, you know, like for example, you say, I've always wanted to meet uh, the uh, host of our local morning show. And so you start to say to your friends, hey, do you know this person? Do you have any connections? And somebody's going to come up and say, oh, yeah, you know, my first cousin, sister is their hairdresser. I guess that actually doesn't make much sense. But a first cousin sister would also be a first cousin. But anyway, so, but you get the idea. It is that... Uh, that connection is stronger and this luck is going to continue past November. So as I said, I will be talking about this more. It, it's basically this aspect is so that you have a more direct path to what you want towards your goals. So as I said, we'll talk about it more later. And that's it. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, please subscribe.